Hey, what is going on guys? So you have a iPhone 10 or 10s, 10s Max, iPhone 10R, even the iPhone 11 and you have issues with charging. Maybe it's not charging, maybe it's charging slowly, or maybe it's only charging to a certain point like 10 or 20% and then it stops. I'm going to give you guys several solutions to get your iPhone back up and running right now. So the first thing is you have to make sure that you have a cable, a charging cable that is good, okay? So if you go ahead and plug your phone in and it's not charging or charging slowly or slowly or whatnot, what you may want to do is if you have an extra iPhone laying around or an iPad or a friend's iPad or iPhone, go ahead and try to charge their iPhone or iPad and see if that works. If it works on another iPhone or iPad, obviously there's something else going on besides the actual charging cable. If you don't have an extra iPhone or iPad laying around, just go ahead and grab yourself another uh, cable and see if that works. If it still does not work, then what I want you to do is try to switch USB ports, okay? Regardless if it's on your computer or a um, one of these uh, multi-charger USB ports, try a different port, okay? Also, another thing too is if you're using a wall adapter, okay, and the wall adapter is not working, then go ahead and try to plug in another socket, okay? Another wall socket preferably keep moving around. If it still doesn't work, go ahead and pop the uh, wall adapter out and find another one you have laying around your house. Like this is one for the Samsung phones, but these work as well. Just go ahead and plug that in, pop it in and see if your iPhone um, ha no longer has any charging issues. And the same thing, even if you're using a cable, like this is a USB-A here to a lightning port here, but a lot of the uh, newer phones, they come with a USB type C to a lightning point, um, connector here so same thing you know if you have the wall adapter and the, the usb type c it's it's not working try a different uh, outlet and if you have another one of these laying around if it's still not working you have another one of these laying around then try a different one another thing i want to note too is you have to make sure that it's plugged in all the way okay if it's only in like three quarters of the way you're going to have issues charging make sure it's in all the way now the thing is if it doesn't go in all the way then it's a good possibility you may have like lint or debris stuck in there and I'll show you how to take that out in one second. Also on the uh, wall adapter here, if you go ahead and plug it in, you also want to make sure that is all the way in on this as well. Same thing if you have a uh, USB-A, you want to make sure that it's in the wall adapter all the way, not three quarters of the way, okay? So if your charging cable is good and your wall adapter is good and it's still not charging, then it's a good possibility you have something inside your charging port here. However, sometimes a simple force restart will get it working too if you have nothing stuck in there, okay? And how you do a force restart is with the phone on, this is what I want you to do. I want you to press the volume up, volume down, and then press and hold the power button until you see the Apple logo, okay? And then plug your phone in and see if it uh, charges or has any issues, okay? So let's do this together. Volume up, volume down, Press and hold the power button. Do not let go of that power button until we see an Apple logo appear. I'm still holding on to the Apple logo, or I'm still holding on to the power button here. I'm still holding on, waiting for that Apple logo to appear. Still holding. There's the Apple logo. Go ahead and let go. Once the phone boots back up, go ahead and plug in your phone and see if it's up and charging like it should. If not, we're going to go to the next step here. Okay, so the next step here, now it's a good possibility you have something stuck in here. It could be lint, dust, debris. Even if you ever spilled a little bit of soda or coffee near it, it can have some sticky stuff in here, okay? So what you can do is go ahead and find yourself a, um, a toothpick, uh, preferably like a wooden toothpick or a plastic toothpick, okay? So what you want to do with the toothpick here is you kind of want to go in here and you kind of want to see if there's anything in here, kind of like move it out right into the charging port, okay? And also uh, take note, if anything happens to your phone, I am not responsible, okay? Anyways, go like this, keep doing this. And a lot of you guys watching this video right now, you're gonna be pulling out a lot of gunk that you never knew that you had in there, okay? So keep doing this, keep playing around with it, and then do that for a while, and then go ahead and plug in your phone again, plug it back in, see if it's charging. If it's not, unplug it and try to do it again. Use the toothpick here. Go ahead and keep trying to clean that out. Also, if the toothpick is not working here, and like I said, you can use a wooden one or even a uh, plastic one, okay? If that's not working, I, what I want you to do next is go ahead and blow into it. So, blow, blow into it kind of hard and use the toothpick 
try it again, and then go ahead and plug it in and see if it works, okay? If it's still not working, then what you may wanna to try to do next is go ahead and get the uh, toothbrush here, or you could have did a toothbrush first, okay? Anyways, get, the, get a toothbrush here, and you kinda of wanna go inside and kinda of clean that out. Try to get the uh, whiskers in there. Move it around a little bit nice and gentle, and then give it a nice blow. Give it a little clean again. And then go ahead and plug in your phone and see if it's charging. Now take note, now there's times where I used a toothpick, it didn't work. I used a toothbrush, it didn't work. And then I went in with a metal paper clip. Now the thing is, I don't, re I don't recommend uh, using a metal paper clip because you shouldn't use metal to metal. However, uh, just take note that I have used a metal paper clip before. And for some reason, when I had that in there and I started moving around, um, it actually started charging the phone so you you can try this if you want but again it's not really advised to use you know metal on metal okay so after you try to clean it out and maybe it still wouldn't charge next thing i want you to do is go ahead and plug in your cable your char your lightning cable plug it in like this and then i just want you to let it sit there for like 10 or 15 minutes maybe it's not charging or not doesn't matter plug it in and leave it like this for 10 minutes Come back after 10 minutes and do the same thing while it's plugged in, okay? I want you to do a forced restart while it's plugged in this time, okay? So remember, follow me. Volume up, volume down, press and hold the power button. I'm going to continue to hold the power button. I'm not going to let go until I see that Apple logo appear. Now, one of these steps, most of you guys are going to be up and running, unless, of course, you do have a defective battery or something is wrong with your connector. I'm still holding on to the power button. Okay, so the Apple logo is there, and I'm going to let go and uh, wait for my phone to boot back up. And you guys should be up and running and charging with no issues. Like I said, if there still is an issue, then you something wrong with your battery, that you have a defective battery, or there's something actually wrong with your charging port here. Anyways, let me know uh, which method or which combination of methods that actually work for you. Any questions, comment below. Thanks for watching, guys.